All right, so from the rules and techniques that most barbers live to tips for customers who want a really good cut, Jason Johns is the owner of Jason's Barber. Um, he joins us with a few grooming tips for men. Oh, go on. Welcome. Morning, morning. Where does barber, barber thing come from now in the first place? Uh, my mother, she was a hairdresser. So it, it, it run in the bloodline. So I said, Mums, you know, I like the barbering. And she said, well, go ahead. You teach yourself to do it or what? Well, I went to children first and then I went to Hart College of Beauty Service where I did my level two, level three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, it seemed like it's not a problem. You put anything on your nose, but it's, it's more than that, though. It's more than that. The techniques, you know, you have to um, know how to use the clippers, know how to guard them, which guard to use. You know what do you mean by know how to guard them? You put on the little, put on, okay. Yes, so you don't go too low or... Too low, yes. yes. I have to tell you what I want, or I just come in and say, Baba, just sort me out now, please, and I just sit down. You have some customers who can tell, tell us what they want, or we have a barber chart where you can pick the styles, yeah. or we can recommend from our previous cuts on social media. Um, I guess with, with me, I cut my hair every single week. Um, every single week I cut my hair. Um, do you have people like that who come? Because I think some people, maybe some of my colleagues who are on TV every single day, maybe every other day, them, them get them little mark up and stuff. Yes, man, every week. And you have some coming there who colored beard, you know, they want to get rid of the greys. Just saying, you know. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> so you mean you dye it? Yes, we dye the beard, line it up. And we have something that we do now, hair enhancement, where we keep the hairline sharp and keep the beard line sharp. So if you want your beard to be permanent black, we use permanent colors as well. You mean permanent black, so it don't, we don't... You don't wash off. So if you wash your face, shampoo your beard, condition it, it won't come off. Never ever? Never ever. Only when it grows out, we we'll apply again or we we'll cut off. Are you serious? Off. Yes. I never know that because I think the dye come out after a while, huh? No, man. Permanent. <laughs> Let's about more I do a little thing right now. You right can... now, ready to go. Ready. Don't play with me, you know? No, not joking. Jason Barber's on, don't play. <laughs> Scott say I can't stop you, shoe polish. Scott, you know me already. I don't use anything at all. But seriously, me on TV every day, you know, don't ramp with me. You know. All right, yet. so just give me a little, just like how you have yours. All right. What, all right. I, what I must do? Come round and stand up here. What I must do? Stay right here? Stay right there. Stay right there. All right. Don't ramp with me, you know. Come on. Joe, to make sure this man do the right thing, you know. So normally you come in, probably how long? You can still hear me, Scott, with this, this thing here? Yeah. Normally how long the, the average haircut would take? It depends on the style. You know, if a customer wants a fade or a mock, that usually takes more time. Yeah. A regular all-in-one, yeah, 15 minutes. What is an all-in-one, Regin? You want me to show you? No, okay. don't pay me. So would I take off everything? That's the mind about all in one. You know, would I take off everything? Yeah. Yeah, so we'll get like a schoolboy cut. No, but I want the fade just like you, you have there, you know. That's why I want it to stay. Fade, all right. Yeah. All right. How long it went take? Because we don't have much to hold it for time, you know. All right. Are we going for now? Man, I'm afraid. Turn some. Oh, them want me to turn some so then you can see what I'm doing. We can take out this thing. Scotty, you can't talk to me now. <laughs> Jody tell me, you know, from him start. Why are you not? You tell me. But you can't stop now. Climb up, you just do everything. Oh, Jody giving you the thumbs up. Yes, man. Where, where is your place? Princeville Plaza. What time you open up? 9 o'clock. Princeville Plaza, shop 13. What else you offer apart from just a, a haircut? So, we offer waxing as well. Waxing? Yes, we are. We that wouldn't like, be for me? Yes, you know, like some customers have the hair growing in them ears and them nostril. You know, tingling your nose, we get rid of that as well. And you wax it? Yes. <laughs> well, uh, where you put it, or you get the wax in there, right? All right, so we use something that calls hard, hard wax. Hard wax? Yes. That's a bit fret. And it never ever grows back? It will grow back, but it takes a longer time to grow back. Yeah. By the way, some people tell me depending on the shape of your face and stuff, certain certain haircut wouldn't suit them. Right, so we have to fit. Give you a haircut that fits the shape of your face, you know, and then sometimes when you have the beard, it gives you a different shape as well. So my haircut suit my face? Definitely, yes. Man. So how much kind of different different shape of face you have? You have the oval, the square, the long. A man have a square face? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're not taking off no hair, you. Yes. No, I'm not different. Thing. 
No, Jody said me good. From Jody said me good, good. Fresh, man, fresh. Where is it? Fresh. Fresh. That's it? What you mean by don't skimp out on the tools? What that mean? Where you Thank want, you, sir. You want to keep your tools fresh. You done? No, I'll brush it off. No, I'll leave the hair on you. Mm. Jody, me good? I don't know, I didn't want some more come out still, you know. But you don't have the time. Yeah. Yeah, so, depending on my, my, my face, mm -hmm. certain things would suit me. Like a mohawk would suit. A mohawk. And then now, you have some customers now would want certain haircuts or certain, like clean shave, for example. And you have some customers, you can't do that because they will get ingrown. Okay. Because most black, black men, them here grow in a coil. So that's how you get the in turn back, you in, turn back yeah, in the skin. Yeah. So you have to be careful and explain to your customer. Some of them will come and say, no, that is definitely that is what I want. Yeah. So what about the people like this man now that want the style? Suppose I did say, I want the St. George's logo or I want a football. You can do all them things, right? Yes, sir. And you teach yourself to do all of that? Well, as I said, I went to Hard College of Beauty Yeah, Service. you did tell me that. Yeah, you did so tell me that. They teach us a lot there. Big up to Hard so College of Beauty That is you Service. right here? Yeah, I did that style, that design. How long something like that would take you? Um, 15 minutes. And that person or requested this. that or you just want to do something Some of them different. come and say, Jason, just, just give just me a style. Something different. Just give me something. So yeah. some of them come and they, they look on social media and say, Jason, you know, I like this style, I want this style. Some of them come now and say, all right, I want the hair for color. Because we're bleaching as well. we we'll bleach the, the hair. Oh, you bleach the hair? Yeah. Okay, all right. So, you know, <laughs> if you want colors as well, you know, some blue. You are the first barber I've seen in a long time that don't look like you need a haircut. <laughs> Serious, almost every single barber always look like them, <laughs> them want a haircut. True. Yeah. <laughs> Blessings, my brethren. All right, respect. Where you are again and what time again? Princeville Plaza, shop 13. How much for a haircut? Um, 2,000 for you. How much for, for me? <laughs> for, for anybody else? Is anybody one? else. So it's 1,800 for a trim and shave. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shave alone? Shave alone, $1,000. Will yeah. you get a complimentary warm towel as well? I get it to carry home? No. Oh. <laughs> so after your service, you get a warm wrap. So 2,000 for haircut, 1,000 for shave? No, 1,800 for a regular haircut and, and shave. Yeah. And for the shave alone? For the shave alone, it's $1,000. So if you shave my head, it's mm -hmm. just $1,000. 1,800. <laughs> <laughs> Jason Johns, owner of Jason's Barber Zone. Um, we'll soon come back. More and smile and I'm good to see you, my brother. And thank you. Good night.